Hello everyone, it's me JB from Unic Tutorials. Today in this video, I will show you how to easily find out if the audio file is stereo or mono using any computer. So without any further ado, let's begin. So before proceeding, let me give you a little knowledge about what really a mono and stereo means. So stereo means you can see here, it's a stereophonic sounds that is you can see here it uses two channels for different directions say it will use one channel for the left directions and the other channel for the right directions so if you're listening a uh, stereo music or audio files then you will definitely found some musics are playing in the left side or the right side and other some musics are playing on the right side sometimes it happens in the most of the stereo audio files so stereo files means using two different channels for different directions that's a simple language so i'm not going technically much about here so it's about stereotypic audio now regarding the monophonic audio files so here you can see here mono audio means that it uses a single file and it will be split into the two directions equally that means it does not use any different channels for different directions so it will use a single channel that is uh, one song will be played similarly on the different directions so if you're listening uh, mono audio then you can listen the same music on both the left and right directions and you won't find any music that is played on differently on the left and right directions so this is all about mono audio files so this is just a basic knowledge i'm not going technically here too like the stereo so this all about a basic knowledge about mono and stereo so let's directly jump into the topic firstly what you need to do is you need to open any web browser and you need to visit to this website i'll be providing this website link in the video description too so you can click there and log into this website so once you log into this website you can see here below download or study so this application is available for the Windows, Apple and even for the Linux computers. So you can download any versions depending upon your needs or which OS you are using in your respective computer. So you download and install it. I'm not going to do it again as I have already downloaded and installed it. So you download and install it firstly. So after installing, what you need to do is just launch the other CD so once you open the other CD software you can see its user interface so here in this folder i have two different audio files say one and two so here i have a two different files so let me show you by going to the properties when you go to the properties and you check on the details you will find whether this audio file is stereo or mono so there is nothing here mentioning that it's a stereo or mono audio file so what you need to do is say i want to check whether this audio file is mono or audio so, so i will drag it so after dragging you can see here it's written mono so the file the first file as you can see on the left hand side is a mono as you can see here mono so let's do the similar way related with the second audio file just drag and drop this so here you can see it's a stereo so here i've explained you earlier that the mono will include the only one audio channel so you can see here uses only one audio channel and here you can see it's written stereo the second audio file so here it's using a different channel for different directions so it's clearly known now that stereo mostly uses a uh, two different channels for different directions and mono uses a single channel for the different directions so using this free of cost software audacity you can easily find out whether the audio file is stereo or mono very easily so if you have never known about this cool tricks then you should definitely try it out today and i'm sure if you're willing to find out or want to know that if the audio file that you were using is a stereo or mono very easily using this software so 
If you like this video tutorial useful, please do share with your friends and relatives. I'm sure they'll be glad to know about this cool tricks too. And if you find this video tutorial useful, click on the thumbs like button. And if you're new to our channel, click on the subscribe button. And lastly, thanks for watching.